forever it's been like months which means the girl is bad at keeping you guys updated and vlogging for you guys because well it's been three months and you know i was supposed to be posting every week but you know there's been life changes things have happened and that's what this video is for i'm gonna spill the tea all the tea literally even more tea like tea is just gonna keep getting spilled so i got this new headband that we're gonna try out together today uh, i got it from ulta it legit is the cutest thing i don't even know what i spent on it because it was cute so i got it also you want to look fashionable i used to put just a straight up headband to do my hair or to do my makeup so now we're going to start off with skincare which you guys don't care about you guys came for the tea so I disappeared for like three months because your girl is pregnant. Yeah, that's what I said. Pregnant. You know, that's the tea. That's the biggest tea of all. Is your girl is uh, uh, pregnant and uh, expecting a child in December. So I'm definitely planning on making a lot of videos from now until December the reason why I technically disappeared for three months is because that was my first trimester in reality and it was horrible like your girl had every bad symptom possible and it was just not cool like I had morning sickness the whole day like when people say morning sickness is morning sickness uh-uh it ain't morning sickness it really ain't it's like all day sickness through the night like yeah and then it's like you don't want to eat because you want to throw up but if you don't eat then you also want to throw up so it's like a lose lose situation all together but you know we're out of obviously the first trimester that's why i'm back and then i've been out of it for a couple weeks now i'm currently 17 weeks while filming this video tomorrow i will be 18 weeks i'm back like i'm better than ever like i don't know the first trimester, this is like nothing. The first trimester was horrendous for me. Like I, people are always like, oh, your first trimester is the worst, which is like, yeah, but I did not expect to feel like that. Like everyone does not make it seem that bad. Like people are like missing half the information that I should have known. Like, mm. so that's like the major T of today's video is that I am pregnant. That is why I disappeared. I'm currently 17 weeks pregnant, if you guys missed that part. I'm doing much better now. I'm ready to live my life to the fullest. Still can't believe I'm gonna be a um, mom in December. But like, mm, you never know. You know, life throws you curveballs and you just live with it. Literally at the beginning of the year, I was living in New York City on my own, like trying to do my dance dream and blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Next thing you know, I come home, find out I have a torn meniscus and I'm, I'm pregnant. So, yeah. So the whole reason why I came home in February and left my program early is because I'm actually torn meniscus on my left knee. I found that out yada yada uh it definitely feels like it's getting better but like of course it's not gonna like heal on its own i have to get surgery but because i am pregnant you are not allowed to have surgery unless it's like emergency where you're gonna like die if you don't get it so i'm currently just going through my pregnancy right now and then after i'm gonna decide on a certain date or like a certain time to obviously get the surgery because at the same time i don't want to like give birth and then like jump into a surgery and miss like my baby's like first month of life like i feel like that's just like disrespectful i cannot do that so i've decided to possibly do it like after a month has gone by 
I feel like that would be a good amount of time after the baby's born to get it done. But that's what's technically going on with my knee right now. There's nothing really going on. I just it's pretty much on hold until nine months go by. Why did I put the concealer so far down? Oh well, it's okay. No one cares. No one, no, no one really honestly cares. As long as it looks good in the end, no one, no one really cares. You know, I can put concealer all over my face and y'all be like, whatever. And some of you will probably judge me, but then also at the same time, some of you guys are gonna be like, she ain't no makeup artist. As long as it turns out gorgeous in the end, no one cares. I feel like a lot of people don't talk about this. Pregnancy is hard. Like people go through a lot and I don't think what you see on the internet and what you go through in real life is not always like real, realistic. And I've definitely learned that pregnancy is a lot. So I'm just trying to enjoy day by day. Another thing that has happened since I got home is me and my boyfriend moved into an apartment alone by ourselves because technically my family moved out of state. That's all I'm going to tell you is they moved. So technically also another thing that has happened since the last time is I transferred colleges. I'm actually now going to a four-year college. I'm gonna be graduating one year later than I technically was supposed to, but my first two colleges that I went to was for dance. And then the college I was at last year was for business. And then now this college is to actually get my bachelor's in business. And we're just here for two more years and that's just that. So, but I am doing the online program because I wanna go in person, like I just, me personally, I don't like going in person. I don't know why I don't. I find more interesting sitting at home, writing notes, learning online, taking all the time I want to read one paragraph if I really want to, than sitting through a class, listening to someone talk for an hour when I could be at home dancing, stretching, making breakfast, like whatever it is what I could be doing within that hour, I'd rather do that than uh, sit in an hour long lecture of someone talking. I just, why does this look so like on camera? It doesn't look that bad in person. Like it really does not. I don't know why it looks that bad on camera. But yeah, I have a lot of stuff happening. Like so much has happened since I last talked to you guys. Like, and I'm pretty sure my last video I made was a get ready with me as well but like this one has so much tea and i'm just talking to you guys like we're literally on facetime but like we aren't and it's just nice like i loved doing this type of video so i just don't know what to do like there's so many options and it's like you guys are all gonna be like unsubscribe this girl is a psycho nothing <laughs> like Living your best life at 20. You know, I could probably also tell that like probably 97, 98, 99% of you are not subscribed. So you should definitely subscribe. And so you can see more of this face. And yeah. Because if you subscribe, I will love you all so very, very much. Or don't. That's fine. It's great. Don't subscribe. It's totally good. I also like you anyways. Then your girl starts school soon. Or junior year technically again. In the fall. I'm just trying to like put like 15,000 things on my plate like I always do. Literally, like when I was in New York City, I had two jobs, dance and college. Now I'm literally gonna do, I'm gonna have two jobs, college, 
I guess I kind of dance, but definitely not half as much as I did before. I'm now making more videos for you guys. I'm not going to disappear unless I hurt myself or something, which I will inform you guys this time. Like, I won't just be like, mm, bye. Let's just drop that on the face of her. And everyone be like, where did this chick go? You guys will find out the baby's gender when I find out. And we're having a whole party get together of mine and baby daddy's fam. We're doing a whole party. Make the whole fam involved in the baby life. While it's still in my stomach. <laughs> I got it on my face. And then, obviously we're gonna have a baby shower, which I have not done anything for. I'm officially done getting ready for today. Which means this video is to conclude. But this is what I look like. But anyways, so I'm obviously officially done. I gave you guys all the tea today. I spilled everything. I spilled all my thoughts. But I hope you guys enjoyed this Get Ready With Me. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment all down below. And I will see you guys next week with another video. Bye, guys.